Hey there guys, Floodmon14 here. Uh, in the last episode, we made it a little further in the tournament, made it past uh, Ishizu and uh, Pegasus. And now, in today's episode, we're going to find out if we can make it past the final goal of the tournament. So let's do it. Let's uh, leave the shop. Let's see who it is. Let's see who it is. Who do you think it's going to be, guys? Well, well, this is my hair, and this is it. Our finalists are the amazing My Hair Employer, Kaiba, and the undefeated Yugi Moto. Ah, hello Yugi. I thought I might be facing you in the finals. <laughs> My Millennium Rod is the final item. Wait. In this game, Kaiba? You know, present day Kaiba has the Millennium Rod? I don't believe in that hocus pocus garbage. No, I'm just kidding. But the rod whispers to me that I must defeat you. <laughs> Kaiba's rod is, you know, whispering to him. You know, just, just, okay, okay, Kaiba. Yugi, prepare to lose. <laughs> okay, Kaiba. Not sure if I can take you seriously there, buddy. Uh, anyway, uh, let's just do it. Let's, uh, now Kaiba is, uh, as you can imagine, he's the finalist. Pretty tough, pretty tough in this game. In fact, there's a card he could, you know, potentially play here. Oh, by the way, listen to this music while I just kind of, you know, do my first couple turns here. Oh, I forgot those two fuse. Um, yeah, great music, great music for the finals. Um, but yeah, there is a card he could potentially play here that would just basically seal it. Let's see if he does it. Oh, he didn't even attack my what? He didn't attack my Tongyo. That's odd. Um, well, I guess let's just. Oh, well, we got a couple dragons. That's good. Let's just. Uh, Use some cards out of our hand here. I think this will make Sword Arm a Dragon, which honestly isn't the best, but let's get rid of this too. Mainly because I, I need to draw some thunders. I need to draw some good stuff. Wait, what? Oh, whoops. Did not think that would fuse. Wait, why did it make the uh, Fire Warrior there? Well, I don't know why he didn't attack me, but we're not going to attack him first. No, no, no. There, maybe that card has a really, 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 really high defense or something. Like, I'm surprised he's not attacking us. What? This isn't what I expected at all. Okay. Which is scaring me even more, honestly. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, there, there's a card, you know, you know, Kaiba could play that would just, uh, it would basically seal the win for him, let's just say. Uh, let's just attack this, I guess. Ah! I mean, that's a pretty good card, too. Not the card I was talking about, but, uh, Labyrinth Ball. Okay. So if it has this sign, I guess we'll watch out for it. If it has Uranus, <laughs> we won't attack it, but, uh... Oh! Metal Guardian! Yeah, I guess that's a pretty good defense, too, but... Okay, so, you know, so far some pretty strong defensive monsters. Not exactly the monster I was thinking of when I made that statement, but let's see if this is it. No! 1380, Reaper of the Cards. I mean, that's... That's manageable. That's doable. Uh, thank you. Thank you for playing that. Um... So we got a dragon on the field, and he didn't attack it, which is good for us. Uh, let's just go into Stone D here. Yeah. Uh, let's choose Mars for no particular reason. Okay, well, I guess let's just do 2150, huh? Let's just do what we can, yeah. Take this out, reaper the cards, bye-bye. Oh man, you're scaring me, Kaiba. You are scaring me, buddy. But, uh, because he's not, he's not playing the card I was thinking of yet. Ah, uh, that sucks. Amphibious Bug Roth. But I think Mystical Sand can take that out. Um, man, we're not getting much here. Let's just, uh, get rid of these two cards. Yeah. Uh, we'll set this in defense. Uh, yeah, Mystical Sand. Destroy this card, please. Thank you. Oh, maybe I should show a couple battles while we're here, though. But man, yeah, this duel is... The music is epic. Um, but I'm not going to delay the suspense anymore. Wing Eagle. Interesting. I'm 
I'm not gonna delay the suspense anymore. And, and I mean, I'm sure you, you guys are smart. I'm, you guys can figure it out. And let's face facts, it is Kaiba. So the card I'm referring to, you know, that can just utterly just destroy us is obviously the, uh, yeah, the card he has, you know, in much of the anime. The Blue Eyes White Dragon. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm like, I'm like 99% sh sure I remember that right. That, yeah, Kaipa does have, uh, you know, here in the tournament finals. I'm like 99% sure he does have, oh, is this new music? Oh, dude, we gotta play more battles. Listen to that. This is new music. Hell yeah. Oh, but yeah, I'm 99% sure Kaiba does have Blue Eyes White Dragon in his deck. It's just like, you know, if he doesn't play it against you, consider yourself lucky. But, I mean, he can play it, you know. I'm pretty sure. Stone Blizzard Attack Magic Spell. Oh, let's turn your Wing Eagle. Oh, look at that. Oh, we're ready to place that Wing Eagle in a fountain, man, as a decoration ornament. You just got turned to stone. Dude, this music. Does this music play anywhere else? <laughs> I'm glad I showed at least one battle in here. Jeez, that that's some good freaking music, man. And then we get back to this music. Oh my god. This game is just awesome. Okay, please don't play your blood. Don't play it. Don't play it. Don't play it. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Stop. Okay, okay. Whew. Okay. Since we have twin headed thunder dragon on the field. I mean, he, maybe he does have some Aquas that would benefit from this. But we're going to play this, Umi, because that will change the field, giving us 3,300. Let's finally beat over this monster, his Labyrinth Wall. Let's do it. Show him what you got, Twin-Headed Thunder Dragon. And let's hear more of the epic music. Oh, my God. This music is so good, dude. Yes. Is this like just for the finals? That is awesome. Wow. Alright. Show them what you got. Thunderbolt. And it looks like I've solved your maze because now your labyrinth wall is destroyed, Kaiba. Oh, this music slaps, bro. I might just show every battle. <laughs> In this tournament final and we'll just you know we'll just do one long episode because man that is some good freaking music bro i'm just saying uh mystical sin uh you know what let's show this battle let's show it flame swordsman oh wait why do you have joey's card yes dude this music makes me just like dude I do not remember this. I, this is freaking awesome, bro. Awesome finals music. All right, Mystical Sam, turn that flame swordsman into a stone swordsman. Show him what you got. Oh, 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 oh dude. Nice. And you know what? Flame Swordsman looked pretty good. Like, you know, just, just the colors as, you know, as the blue and red was changing the stone. Oh, man. Epic. Epic, guys. What can I say? All right. I am my turn. All right, Kaiba. Even if you play your blue eyes not well, then again, I'm sure most like, like most AI in this game, Kaiba can also power up his blue eyes. If he does that... I mean, it, it's basically over, man. Like, if, you, if he does that, just be like, man, just just realize, like, it's not your fault. Just realize, like, hey, I had some really rotten luck here, and it's just, you know, yeah, it's just one of those things. Uh, let's try it with Mystical Sam. Oh, it worked. Battle Steer. Okay. Okay. Twin-Headed Thunder. Get him. And Magical Ghost. Lightning Strike Attack. All right. We're doing a lot better here than I expected. I mean, I expected to do this duel like three or four times, kind of like Pegasus, but uh, okay, practical. That's, that's a solid monster. That's solid. But uh, I guess we got lucky here and Kaiba just. 
Kaiba got, Kaiba got a crap draw, man. I, I don't know what else to say. All right, Turtle Bird time on Umi. Let's go with Saturn and Turtle Bird. Let's show. Oh, with the Guardian Star. Let's show you. Let's show you. And let's hear some more of this awesome epic finals music, guys. Yeah, rap and spin, baby. Oh, it's Marnie the dinosaur. Show him what you got, Turtle Bird. Water gun attack. <laughs> what killed the dinosaurs? A Turtle Bird. That's what. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, sorry if you guys hear like a big. Uh, Look like there was just some kind of big bus driving by here. That's that's weird. Normally we don't. Well, anyway, yeah. Sorry if you heard any like really loud noises, but uh, anyway, back to the finals. And twin headed thunder dragon, finish it off. Wow, I can't believe we made it past Kaiba first try. Like honestly, well, we got lucky there, guys. Trust, trust me, trust me. Oh, we got pretty lucky there. And speaking of lucky, we'll make that a two for her. We got Petite Dragon. Hmm, I'll show you guys that after this school. All right, what do you have to say for yourself, Kaiba? Can't believe we got that off a of D rank. Ah, what what is going on here? This this cannot be me defeated. How, Yugi? I despise you. Um, what's gonna happen now? Uh, what the light? Oh no, it's it's so bright. No, no. And uh, the Millennium Broad looks a little different in this game. Uh, well, and for you guys that don't know, this game was actually made before like uh, the manga was completed. Uh, so I'm not sure the manga was up to Battle City at this point. So just just pretty interesting fact about this game. Uh, my my Millennium item drawn into a card. How? And that also might explain why Kaiba... Oh, oh, something's happening here. I now have all the cards with the Millennium items. Oh, right. I mean, that kind of was, you know, after Shoddy let us know what's going on, what the deal yo yo was. I mean, that kind of was like the goal of this tournament. So what's going to happen now? Let's see. Okay. Whoa. Pretty cool cutscene here. Some nice, nice lighting. Looks, looks great. Looks great for just regular PlayStation. Floodmon 14, I, I did it. Is, is this what you wanted? And now, we are once again inside the Millennium Puzzle. And it's good old Simon, Floodmon 14, you've done it. Ah, now you can go back to your own world. Oh, okay, so this is, uh, you know, unlocked, like, some kind of feature within the puzzle to let us uh, go back to uh, ancient Egypt. Hmm, okay. All right. You have that boy, Yuki, to thank for this. Oh, yeah, I mean, true, he did, you know, help us with the blank cards and stuff and getting all the items, so. Yugi, if I may be so bold, I believe the boy represents what you are to be, Flood. Prince Flood. Now... Now with the Millennium items pulling at each other over time, the portal to our world can be opened. Oh, okay, okay, so let's see what's gonna happen here. Whoa, that looks ominous AF. Haishin now has six of the Millennium items and rules of an expansive realm. Oh no, he has six of the items? Uh, well, I'm, did, did we, uh, well, well that's, that's, uh, that can't be good, right? I mean, the bad guys having the Millennium items, we, we have to do something about this. Using his items, he has managed to unleash a portion of the powers of darkness, my prince. Uh, he has placed each item in temples located at each conquered area to protect his soldiers. Ah, okay, Simon. Prince Fledmon 14, you must retrieve all the items. We can't allow Hai Shin to have his way. And seal them away once and for all. I agree, Simon. Can't let the bad guys have the money and items. I mean, so so this isn't looking good. I mean, I mean, but I mean, we have a chance to stop them. So that's what we're banking on here. The locations of the temples containing the Millennium items can be found in the ruins. Oh, okay. 
in the ruins. So we had to go to the ruins. My time has come. Uh, what are you saying, Simon, buddy? What, what, what's going on? I, I, I've done all I can do. My flesh is no more. These will be my last words to you, Fledman 14 Prince. Oh no, Simon! No, oh, Simon. Well, well, thanks for helping us, buddy. I mean, you did your best, you know, back there in the ancient past to stop Haishin. You know, and ultimately we had to shatter the puzzle, but all right, thanks, buddy. I mean, I appreciate it. I'll, I'll, I'll try to do my best to obtain all the items for you. All right, and save the world. The rest is up to you. Good luck. All right, may success be yours. Thank you, Simon. Thank you. All right, and now, what's gonna happen? Made it back. This looks like the ruins of a temple. Mm, there's nobody here. Okay. So, you know, now that we, so uh, Yugi, you know, there in the present helped uh, with the blank cards from Prince, Prince uh, Floodmon 14, uh, helped us to open a portal back to ancient Egypt, to where now we have a chance to stop Haishin once and for all. Um, so now that you're back in the uh, um, this part of the game, obviously you want to save first things first, but uh, there are some duels you can get into, let me just warn you. So don't go here to the Pharaoh's Palace. Um, instead, what you want to do, let's just check out, um, you know, uh, the old card shop. Let's check out. Let's check out what's happened uh, since we um, we were here the last time. So let's go to the old card shop, and maybe we can find the guy and save. I mean, everything's destroyed. Oh man, it doesn't look good. There's nobody around. Okay, okay. So there's no one there. Okay. In the plaza, we can't go to the plaza. So let's just go to the old dueling ground. Maybe we'll. Uh, Maybe this is a safe area? I hope so. I hope everyone's okay. Uh, Jono, Tayana, I hope you guys are here. Nobody's here. Looks abandoned. Aw, oh, man. I wonder what happened to Jono, man. He's our buddy. Yeah. Hey, Flood Mom 14. <gasps> Jono! I'm glad to see you, buddy. Yeah. Wow, you're alive. Uh, oh, right, right. I never dreamed I would see you again, Prince Flood Mom 14. Yeah. Yeah. I still can't believe it. You know, I was really surprised when I f first learned that you were actually a prince. Oh, right. Yeah, we, we were kind of, you know, incognito when we first went to the dueling grounds. You know, we were dressed as kind of someone normal. But uh, now Jono knows, obviously, since, you know, everything Haishin's done. Eh, it, it's good to see you, buddy. Eh, I never dreamed that you managed to get away from Haishin and all those guys. Yeah, Flood Mob 14. It's not good, man place has changed since you disappeared. It's a sad situation, but the duels still go on at a secret location nearby. Oh man, well, I mean, I mean, I can imagine, I can just imagine, you know, what tyrannical things, you know, Haishin did, you know, after thinking he succeeded in uh, getting rid of us. And, uh, you know, so yeah, it, it, I can imagine the situation's pretty bad, but you know, yeah, come on, buddy, I'll take you there. Oh, thanks, Jono. Let's go. All right, Jono. Take us away, buddy. Eh, here you go. This is where we set up our new dueling grounds. Uh, honestly, this place looks pretty good. Uh, I'm guessing this is like some kind of secret, you know, underground layer. Uh, but uh, that's that's awesome, Jono. Awesome. Eh, Floodbound 14. The major spent days trying to find out where you might have run off to. Oh, okay, okay. Eh, when we said we had no idea, they destroyed the all old dueling ground. Oh, that sucks, Jono. I'm sorry to hear that, but I'm glad you're okay. I'm glad you're okay. Uh, what about Tiana? What about our, uh, everyone else? Yeah, that's why me and the car shop owner moved the dueling ground down here. Oh, okay. I mean, that makes sense. So they are kind of underground. It's implied somewhere. So. Flood, you're still alive. There's Tiana. Hi. There you are. Yeah. What'd you expect? Flood Mom 14 isn't dumb enough to be caught. Yeah. You know, it's a miracle that you managed to elude them. I mean, well, we did it not without any help. I mean, I mean, Simon helped us big time, and uh, we had to use some powers from the puzzle and some help from our um, our uh, descendant in the future, Yugi. So, you know, not without some help, but you know, yeah, yeah, those guys taking over the entire kingdom. They do as they please, control everything. Oh, Jono, man, breaking my heart, buddy. And they will some kind of strange magic, man. I don't understand it. And 
and nobody can stand up to them in the powers. Oh, okay. Okay, so they're using the powers of the Millennium items. Yeah, that's kind of what Juno's saying here. The way things are going, we we'll have to live down here for the rest of our lives. Oh, no, Juno. I, don't worry. I'll, I'll change the situation. I'll, I'll try to we'll, I'll try to help fight him back, buddy. And pull in my 14. Yeah, feel like doing, buddy. Uh, it beats moping around just worrying about things. You know, I feel you, Jono, but uh, I'm actually gonna. Well, I hope I can duel both of these. Um, but I kind of want to save after that duel was set up, so let's decline for now. And okay, maybe next time. The old man runs Koch up down here, too. Drop in when you got the chance. Okay, see, that's what I wanted to see. See you around, Flood. Alright, see you, Tayana. Alright, so, um. Uh, what time are we at here? Okay, so now, now that you've done that, what will be available is, uh, yeah, hiding card shop and old card shop. So where you want to go to save is hiding card shop right here. So let's do that. And uh, I don't want to miss anyone. I haven't seen you for a while. As you can see, I'm still around. Yeah, glad to see you're okay, buddy. Uh, so let's just do what you want to do to save. It's just you can choose dueling grounds to go to the hiding dueling grounds or the card shop now from here. So, but what you want to do is card shop so you can save, obviously. So, uh, ooh, but should I? I I'm pretty sure you can still still duel anyone. I know I I chose to skip them there, but I I really really hope I didn't skip uh, uh, some duels that can happen there. But I'm pretty sure I didn't. But yeah, let's just go ahead and save here. And let's let's build our deck. Let's put that uh, dragon in our deck here real quick. And I think we're going to end the episode there. So this is what we want from Kaiba. Yeah, a very small dragon of her vicious attacks. So we got pretty lucky. Honestly, like, I've never really gotten that lucky in the campaign. We won Darkfire Dragon from Pegasus. And this from Kaiba? Two dragon? That's, that's like really, 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 really good, honestly, uh, as far as luck goes. Um... Because, yeah, they don't necessarily always drop dragons. So, like, that was... That is shocking to me. I'm, I'm actually really glad that's how it turned out. Um, well, I tell you what. Fire Reaper's, like, the last zombie we've got in here. Yeah, let's just go ahead and swap out Fire Reaper probably for a petite dragon, I'm thinking. I'm thinking... Um, all right, now I do still need to try Gigatap Wolf out to see if he makes, like, a Flame Cere Cerebrus. If he doesn't, then I'll probably put Fire Reaper back in. But uh, for now, let's just swap that. Okay, and then we'll save. And I think we'll call it an episode, guys. So, what can I do for you? I want to save. Uh, but next time, we will return here back to ancient Egypt. And, um... Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do uh, Tiana and, and Jono again. You know, just for old time's sake. So, uh, and also see uh, see what else is going on, you know, back here in ancient Egypt, you know, now that we've come back. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. Uh, but, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys all next time in Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. You guys have a good day, take care of yourselves, and each other. Alright, bye.